Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am here with a Scentsy haul. So what I have right here is the warehouse sale plus some other items. This got to me really quickly. I thought it was gonna take a really long time. Scentsy is saying, I think your orders can ship in up to 21 business days for turnaround. So I was in no rush to get this order, but mine shipped out really quickly. So I am uh, really excited to, to have my order. I also just wanted to take a quick second to say in this video that if you ordered from me during that sale, thank you so very much. I can't express how much I appreciate it. It just helps me put money back into this channel and yeah, keep making videos and doing what I love to do, which is talk about wax. So thank you so very much. We're gonna have to make this really quick. I need to get to work, <laughs> so I don't have a ton of time. I've got like 15 minutes. So I've got a bunch of bars in here I don't have the set note, so I'm just gonna kind of quickly run through everything that I got. I do have some other items in here. So there were some items on the clearance and some um, bars that I wanted just in the current catalog. So what I did is the warehouse sale started at noon central time. So I went on the site around like 11.30, 11.45, and I put the other items that I wanted from just the regular clearance, or the catalog into my cart so that they were already in my cart ready to go then the system like the website closed down and went into the queue system then i got in filled up my cart with my flash sale items and i checked out so i had my clearance and just regularly offered items plus everything for the flash sale and then i was able to check out quickly because i already had those other items in my cart and i didn't have to spend the time like after I put everything in my cart from the warehouse sale, go back and like browse through other things that I wanted. So quick tip for you, if there's anything during a flash sale that you know you wanna just add to an order before the website closes down um, and it puts you into the queue system, get in there and put it in your cart beforehand. So I'll try to go through some of those things first. I got, I think just a couple of items. So. In the clearance, there was the Scentsy Fresh in Icicles and Evergreen. I wanted this for spraying down the curtains and the towels and the bed linens and things like that. Um, I clean the house every weekend. And so kind of my last step is to spray like a Febreze or that type of product, like a Scentsy Fresh all over like my curtains and things like that. And that's like my final touch, my last thing I do for cleaning for the week is to just kind of freshen up those linens. And so I wanted this one because it's got the tree note to it and I'm a big fan of tree scents. Don't wanna get this on my dress. Well, this smells really nice. I've never had the scent in wax or anything like that. And I've only, I sprayed this once <laughs> right when I got this package just to see what it smelled like because I was curious, but I will be excited to give that more try. I also picked up from the clearance section um, pods in Dancing Sugar Plums. So these were on sale for half off. So they came out to $5 and I've been using the pods in my car and for five bucks for two, that's a really great deal. And so I wanted to throw this in my car. I'm not sure if I'd ever tried this scent or not, but it smells good. Just like a, yeah, like a sugary Christmassy plum. This will be good this winter. And the fact that it was only $5 made that super um, easy to throw in. I can't remember if these pods were in the warehouse sale or if they were in the clearance, but I picked up two pods, um, two packs of pods in Mighty Pine. Again, cause I just, I love the tree scents and they were on sale in one form or the other. It was either the flash sale or it was the um, clearance section. So I grabbed two of these. Just a beautiful tree. Pine is my favorite type of tree note. So this is really good. I would, I would use this in the fall, in the winter. Love that. So I'm glad I picked up two of those. And then I wanted to get the Lilo and Stitch bars because when they came out, I threw them both in my club, but my club doesn't ship until September. I only have a quarterly club 
And so I thought I, I wanted to try these before then if possible. And so I thought, okay, I know I'm gonna make a warehouse sale more than likely. So get in, put these bars in your cart. That way you, you have them. So I did get both of these. So the Stitch Experiment 626. <clears throat> this is a really pretty bar and I love this color. I can see it why people like this. It's fruity, it's citrusy, it's fresh. I think I will enjoy this bar, but I don't know that this will be an absolute favorite. So I need to melt this before my club processes in September, just to see what I think about it. Cause I did put two bars of both of these in my club, um, just in case I, I really enjoy them. I can see why people like this bar a lot and it is very pretty. I'm just not a huge citrusy person either. So I'm excited to try this and see what this is like. And then Angel Experiment 624. This one is really popular as well. Both of these bars are this bar, you guys. Oh my gosh. I love this. This smells like cotton candy, but sweeter. Like you mixed bear, like fresh berries with cotton candy. Yeah, it's a very berry heavy, like sweet, sugary scent. This is really, really pretty. Yeah, I love this. This is a total winner in my book. And yesterday when I got this package, I kept going like to this package and smelling this bar because it just, it smells so good. Berries, cotton candy, sweet, sugary, perfect for like bedroom, bathroom. I cannot imagine this would be a powerhouse. So I probably will not put this in the open concept, but bedrooms and bathrooms, I think this would be stunning. Mm, I love this so much. Okay, so I need to melt this too. Make sure it performs like I'm thinking on warm. And then, like I said, I do have two more coming in my club in September. Okay, and then the rest, yeah, is clearance bars. So I don't have the notes for everything. Just gonna do like a quick sniff here. Sea salt and avocado. So you can get this scent in the brick for Scentsy Club like half price items. And I never tried this and a lot of people have told me that they think that I would really enjoy this scent just based on the type of scent notes that I like. So since it was in the flash sale hall, I was like, or warehouse, whatever it's called now, I definitely wanted to pick it up. And this is good. This is really fresh and clean. I do get a sea saltness. I think the avocado kind of threw me off at first. I was like, what the heck is that gonna smell like? I, you know, I don't wanna smell like an avocado toast, <laughs> but it, it doesn't smell like avocado. It's just like a creamy, fresh scent with some salt. This is really pretty. A good spring scent, or just kind of like fresh bathroom all year round scent. I gotta get a move on here, I think I need to speed it up Alexis. Um, aloe vera and ivy. This one is really good. This is fresh, clean, kind of cucumbery. Yeah, it definitely has a melon or cucumber note to it, but it's soft and fresh and it's not melon like fruit in your face. It's just kind of like a spa or body care-esque. Yeah, this is pretty. Probably don't need more than one of them, but that's good. This one, I got four of these because as soon as I saw it, I was like, oh yes, that sounds so good. And that is a spiced pear. Does that not sound amazing? And I had seen, I think Michelle was talking about this a while ago about how she really likes the scent. This is really nice. Really, really pretty. Perfect for September. It reminds me a little bit of honey pear cider. Not that they're dupes, but just kind of that, that scent family of honey pear cider. Although this does smell pretty light. So I'm hoping that this cures a little bit more, but you would think that this is an older bar at this point, but I'm going to melt this in September for sure. See what I think, but really like that one on cold. Darling Dahlia. I do remember I had this one years ago 
years ago they this was out in maybe a catalog or I bring back my bar or something and it's pretty it's just kind of like a fruity floral scent yeah a fruity floral not a total favorite or anything but that is a pretty bar all you need is love I have had this one in the past this this is another bar that was out years ago like 2017 2018 time frame and I don't particularly care for this one there's something about it and I remember smelling it as soon as I smelled smelled this I was like oh yeah like it just wasn't for me it's very it reminds me a little bit of coffee or like a mocha with some spices to it yeah this one's not my favorite I'll probably pass this bar on um to somebody that I think would like it better. I have three more. Simply Irresistible. Some of these I've never even heard of. Very fresh cologne spa type of scent. This one's pretty. I like this one. This will be pretty in the springtime or for the bedrooms and bathrooms. country plum anything that has like plum in its name I'm like yes let me try that <laughs> don't know what makes this country this has an interesting note to it that I'm not really sure about but it's plum something else it almost smells like a vegetable like I get like a vegetable garden note I have to look up the notes to see what this is supposed to be but I do, I get like a garden greenery type note to this and a little bit of plum. This one, it's not my favorite on cold, but I'm curious about it. Okay, and then last but not least is Best in Snow. I thought that sounded so pretty, especially with winter, you know, coming up here in the next few months. Just a pretty minty, like minty in spa. Like I definitely get like a freshness like a, a cleanness. Like this would be a really pretty body care in the winter where it's very fresh and clean, but you've got like the mint and peppermint. Yeah, this is good. Glad I think I've, I got the perfect order. Like I'm glad I got four of Spice Pear. I'm glad I got one of everything else. Sometimes with these flash sales, it's so hard because you just don't know if you're going to love a bar and you didn't get multiples of it or what. But I think that was a perfect order and it wasn't anything too crazy. I'm glad I got the Lilo and Stitch bars and some things that I had been eyeing in the clearance as well. But that's it. Sorry, this was so quick, but sometimes you got to fill when you have the time. So I'm going to head off for the day, but I hope that you guys enjoyed this haul. Let me know down in the comments what you picked up from the Scentsy Warehouse haul. I'd love to know and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.